Hello everyone and welcome to a completed album review of the Panini Foot 2021 League Uh sticker collection. It's officially licensed from Panini, the only official League Uh sticker collection. I love saying League Uh because you get an emphasis on the Uh part. Um, but yes, we're going to have a look at the album. It's fully completed and thank you very much to the guys over at Panini for sending over the album with all of the loose stickers. You may have seen my TikTok where I opened it up expecting it just to be an album and out came the whole set of stickers and it went over the floor. But I managed to stick them all in and this is what the album is going to be looking like in this video. A completed album. So if you're excited to have a look at this album, make sure to smash the like button. You've got five seconds. Really simple to do. We're going to have a look at the League uh, sticker collection. So have you hit that like button yet? Brilliant. Let's get into the video. That's right, this video is once again sponsored by the legends over at One Football. There is a link in the description where you can download their app for completely free and keep up to date with all the latest football scores from around the world, including the Champions League. What's more is that it gives in-depth player statistics as well as transfer news to help keep you up to date with what is going on and who's performing particularly well in the world of football today. What's not to love? So stay in the loop of the footballing world by downloading the One Football app today. The link in the description will take you directly to whichever app store your device uses. Easy as that. Thank you very much, and let's get on with the video. So as you can see on the front, it has the Panini Foot 2021 branding. It's a really nice design, actually. It's got kind of um, pastel-y. They've kind of edited the players in like a pastel effect. So it's kind of a half-drawn, half-real photo. It is, it's hard to explain, but you would have seen from the cinematics um, at the start of the video um, what they look like. We've got Kamavinga there. We've got Talvan. Mbappe, of course, their AOR heavily linked to a move to the Premier League uh, last summer. And then Renato Sanchez, of course, was in the Premier League uh, a couple of years back with Swansea. Um, there we go. So, La Collection Officielle du Football Francais, uh, UNFP, I'm guessing that's the French Football Association, League 1, and it has League 2. Um, so if you do want to pick up some of these Foot 21 stickers, you can. They're on the Panini online website. I'll leave a link in the description uh, where you can order some of these stickers for yourselves. And uh, yeah, it's great that Panini's UK store are releasing some of the international collections. I think they've got the La Liga stickers, the Italian League stickers... Um, and a La Liga Adrenal XL on there as well. And I'm really tempted to get some of the La Liga cards on the channel as well. So if you do want to see that, make sure to smash the like button once again. Uh, but yeah, when you open it up, it's pretty similar to the um, Premier League set. Because obviously it's made by the same company as Panini as well. Uh, but you do get the map here, which I really, really like. Of all the teams in League 1 and 2. And uh, yeah, it looks really cool. There's quite a big spread of teams all throughout France. It's awesome. And then we got um, the front two stickers there. The La Ligue 1 trophy and the Ligue 2 trophy. Uh, which is awesome. So, and then you obviously get a poster in the middle of your album, which you have to take out to put in all the stickers. But basically the poster is the front cover. And then you have some stickers to stick in on this poster as well. Um, you've got the French selection and then the rest of the world selection. It's, re it's a really cool feature, actually. I really like it. Uh, so let's run through the French team first. This might be easier said than done because it's a very large poster. We've got um, Mandanda in gold, Dubois, Koscielny, Kempembe, uh, Moassa, Awa, Andre, Kamavinga, and then Mbappe, Paye, and Ben Yedder up top. And the manager is Christophe Galtier of Lille. Uh, the rest of the world XI, as you can see there, in gold is Kalon Navas. We've got Juan Bernat. Uh, Alvaro Gonzalez, Marquinhos, Hamurai Traore, Marco Verratti, Renato Sanchez, Memphis Depay. Memphis Depay in midfield there, interestingly enough. Uh, Angel Di Maria, Casper Dolberg and Neymar Jr., of course, um, leading the front line. And then Andre Villas-Boas, obviously former uh, Chelsea and Spurs manager in the Premier League. We'll be familiar with him. So there we go. That's the really awesome inset poster, which you have to take out from the middle of the album. So just be careful when you're doing that. Um, yeah, really like it. It's awesome. Um, there obviously is transfer update stickers in this collection, which I haven't got my hands on because I don't think they were even released in France yet. So um, when they get released, hopefully I can get some to open on the channel uh, to fully complete this album. But anyway, this is it complete so far. We've got uh, the uh, a bit of a feature about the, the Lyon women's team. Now, they're a pretty big force in Europe, if you don't know. They've won the Champions League a lot of the time. There's loads of... Um, stickers of them winning various trophies throughout the years, and uh, yeah, I think they're what I think they are the best team in the world. The Leon French, uh, Leon women's team. I could be wrong, but I mean, look at all of these, um, <laughs> all these trophies they've won. They've won all sorts of Champions League trophies, etc. So fair play to them. And then this is what the team sets look like, and I really like it. It's a really nice design. Um, 
granted, I don't know many of the players because the French league, let's be honest, it's not the best league in the world, is it? But it looks really cool and it's, it's a good a good way to learn a bit more about um, different leagues, which I really like. So if you do fancy doing that, again, you can buy this product on uh, Panini's UK website, and uh, which is fantastic. It has manager stickers down there. As you can see, we've got Stefan Moulin. It's pretty similar to the Premier League stickers. They're pretty, you know, straightforward, easy to understand. I don't know much French at all, but you can pretty much tell what the stickers are saying, um, which is good. So it's quite, you know, friendly uh, to the eye. And then it has their formation down there. So that's Ongers SCO has their badge sticker as well. And then the next page, this is where the transfer stickers will go. I think there's uh, four there, but it'll be split up into two stickers so two stickers will give you four stickers if that makes sense what i really absolutely love about this collection is the kit stickers now this one you can't stick in this one here but you can stick in this one let's take the poster out temporarily but i don't know if you can tell it's hard to pick up on the camera but that is literally a fabric right there so it's like a t-shirt football shirt fabric on a sticker it looks it it just feels awesome and i hope they bring that into the premier league next season because that would be a bit of a game changer because i i absolutely love it i don't know if they've been doing this in the league Ooh, collection for a while but yeah it's awesome it's got a uh, little shiny stickers here got um i'm guessing it's captain star player rising star whatever i think that's the rising star section up there um, but there we go. Nice. So that's what the team sets look like. Now we can have a look at the other teams. So got Bordeaux there. I, think, I believe they won League uh, Didn't they win it with Maran Shamak up top? I could be wrong. With, uh, obviously, speaking of former Arsenal players, Laurent Koscielny. And um, there he is for Bordeaux. Um, yeah, let us know if you can recognise a few of these names. We've got Josh Madger there. And there is their second page again with the beautiful kit sticker. Oh, I love it. And Josh Madger again there. Lovely. And then we've got Stad Brestois, 29. There we go. Don't know many of those players, I can't lie. I'm so sorry, Stad Brestois fans in the comments section. But do let us know if you fancy picking up some of these stickers. Um, I'd probably recommend it. It's, it's great fun. And it's, you know, sticker collections, they're just awesome. So, yeah. Plus, I mean, this, it does look really cool. Um, who do I recognise in this team? We've got Roman Amalfitana, former Newcastle player. I believe he went on to play for West Brom. Could be wrong there. I don't know if he did play for West Brom, but... Yeah, he definitely played for Newcastle. Uh, Bursant Salina, he's definitely played in the championship for a couple of clubs, Bursant Salinas. Ipswich, I'm pretty sure, was one of them as well. Um, there we go. Obviously, we may be able to recognise some of the managers as well. There we got RC Lawns there. I'm uh, not sure I recognise any of these. Uh, there we go. Nice. Looks really, really nice. I love that kit, by the way. That is a that is a nice niche kit, I have to say. Uh, then we've got Lille. There's Christophe Galtier, obviously the French select manager there. And then we've got Jose Fonte there, former Southampton player. Uh, so some pretty big names in this Lille uh, side. There we go. It looks really nice. There we go. Uh, Jonathan David, their rising star there. I think that might be their captain, Mike Magnan. Then Renato Sanchez, their star player. I could be wrong, though. Um, who knows? Uh, then we've got Lorient. Uh, there we go. Trevor Chalabar there. And who else we've got here? Sylvain Marvo used to play for Newcastle. There we go. There is the L Lorient second tier, uh, page, should I say. Uh, their manager being Rudy Garcia. We've got Akambi there. Memphis Depay went, well, was obviously playing for Manchester United for a few seasons. Uh, Cornet, Moussa Dembele used to play for Celtic. Aouar, heavily linked with a move to Arsenal, Liverpool. All sorts of teams in uh, last summer's transfer window. Uh, Anthony Lopez there, Jason Denaya, De Chiglio. So, yeah, this is a pretty big team in um, the French League. Lyon, of course. There we go. And their star player being Hassan Alwa. Then we've got Olympic Marseille, another team in the Champions League collection by Tops. Uh, Andre Villas-Boas being their manager. Tovan there, Paye, Jaman. Um, so, yeah, pretty awesome selection of players there. Uh, there we go. Amarvi, didn't he play for Aston Villa for a couple of seasons? Could be wrong. Um, there we go, and again, that kit sticker is just beautiful. Uh, and then we've got FC Mets there. But yeah, this just does feel like a really nice sticker collection. They do, it just does feel right. It feels like an, um, a retro old school sticker set, which I love. Um, I love that nostalgia feel you get about this. Here we've got AS Monaco. Nico Kovac, obviously their manager, former Bayern Munich manager, got sacked after thumping. I don't know who it was against, but they got thrashed by someone and he got sacked straight after the game. Uh, there's Ben Yedder, of course. FIFA fans will know him. Cesc Fabregas, former Arsenal legend, and then obviously went on to play for Chelsea in Barcelona. Uh, Stefan Jovetic used to play for Manchester City. Kevin Volland, Jelson Martins. Uh, yeah, so a lot of good players in this uh, Monaco set, as you can see. Love to see it. And there's Ben Yedder again on the next page. Golov in there for Farner. And then we've got all the fixtures, which is nice. I love that. So it's got all the fixtures. 
This is where the poster was, so I managed to take it out nicely and then reassemble the album so it didn't damage it, which is nice. Uh, and then we've got Montpellier there. There we go, there's Montpellier. Steffi Mavididi, former Arsenal youngster. Get him on Football Manager. If you play Football Manager, I recommend this chap. He is incredible, Steffi Mavididi. Uh, there they go. There is uh, Montpellier. Then we got Nantes. Fabio there, uh, former Manchester United player. Played for QPR, actually, for a couple of seasons. Um, Mehdi Abide, I think he went. He was playing for Newcastle. Moses Simon there. Gene uh, Kevin Agustin, I believe he was on loan at Leeds last season. He used to play for Leipzig and didn't actually play too much at all. Everyone was hyping him up and he... Uh, didn't play much at all, but there we go. Pedro Kiravea, isn't that the one who is on loan from Liverpool? Am I wrong? I could be wrong, but there we go. There's FC Nantes. And obviously, I don't know if you can see in the background there, there is a picture of their stadium, and you can see Emiliano Sala, unfortunately the one who crashed on his way back to Cardiff, because he obviously transferred from Nantes to Cardiff, and unfortunately his plane crashed in the English Channel, which is sad. So rest in peace to him. It's nice they've got a massive tribute to him, with, along with some of the other legends of this team. Which I really like the kit of, by the way. It's beautiful. Uh, so there we go. Then we've got OGC Nice. We've got uh, Youssef Atal there again. FIFA fans, you know him. Uh, Dante, uh, Brazilian legend there, of course. Patrick Vieira as their manager. That is pretty epic. Um, who else we got here? Kasper Dolberg. Um, so yeah, some pretty good names in this team as well, Nice. Um, very good team, has to be said. There we go. And then we've got Nimes Olympique. Don't know if we know any of those, unfortunately. Sorry, Nimes. And then we've got Paris Saint-Germain. Now, I'm pretty sure everyone watching this video will know pretty much all of these players. Um, there we go. I mean, look at that. Mbappe, Neymar. There is Thomas Tuchel. Um, is Thomas Tuchel still because obviously he's now he was sacked or he left or whatever. Now he's managing Chelsea in the Premier League. But yeah, a pretty impressive side there for Paris Saint Germain. And Neymar, of course, their lovely stuff. And then we've got Stad Rems. Very, very nice. Uh, someone born in Scotland there, Fraser Hornby. Let us know in the comment section if you know much about Fraser Hornby. There we go. Then we've got Stad Rens, another team in the Tops Champions League set. Camavinga there. Very popular sticker, I'm sure. Um, Steven Zonzi used to play for Stoke. Martin Terry, a fantastic player and football manager again there. And Bayern Niang. Um, so again, some really cool cool names in this collection. It has to be said, Daniel Rugani playing for Stad Ren. Forgot about that. There, there we go. Then we've got AS Saint Etienne. There we go. But there we go. Claude Puel, former Southampton manager, as we know. There we go. Was he the one who got them to a Carabao Cup final? Who knows? Then we've got uh, Strasbourg. There is Strasbourg, and this is the famous sticker which I had to order on eBay for because I accidentally stuck it there. Um, when I peeled it off, it was irrecoverable, so I had to throw it away. So I had to order the next uh, the replacement off eBay and stick the one it was meant to go there in its rightful spot. Silly GVW, but uh, there we go. It's all done now, and it looks fine. Then we've got the Ligue 2 um, team. So with Ligue 2, it literally just has their badge sticker and uh, some of these duo ones here, which is really, really nice. I love it. And it just gives an insight into the second division. Has their full squad down there. Bit of badge history. I love the badge history they've got here as well. So there we go. Um, there are the first four teams. Then we've got Chambly, Oise, Clermont, Foot, Chateauroux, and Dunkirk. Then we've got uh, Grenoble, uh, Evant, Guingamp. Uh, there we go. Yeni Umbakato. Um, I don't know if that is that how you say his name. I've completely forgotten, but he used to play for QPR, this chap here. Yeni Umbakato. Then we've got uh, Havre, Nancy Lorraine. Uh, Chamois, Paris FC there, we've then got Pau FC, Rodez Aviron Football, Sochaux, Toulouse in the second division of French football now, um, Troyes and Valenciennes, and there we have it, that is the collection, fully done, and I'm pretty sure you can get three additional stickers there from some sort of promotion over in France, which I can't obviously access, um, but there we go, that is the fully completed Panini Foot 2021 League 1 slash League 2 sticker collection. If you want to see some more international set releases on this channel, make sure to smash the like button. It really would be appreciated if you do. Um, comment down below which sets you would like to see. Um, I'm definitely thinking about doing a Drenal XL La Liga on the channel. A couple of openings on that, like I did last year, because uh, that is an awesome collection. Maybe even the Serie A set as well. So do let us know again. Um, show your support. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And hit the notification bell. Reason me if you don't hit the notification bell, you won't be notified to your mobile, tablet, or computer device when I upload a new video, which isn't what you want, is it? But yeah, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.